Top 10 Terrifying Civilizations of History It is believed that even the earliest of humans had the magic recipe of civilization stored right between their ears. Even then, it took our ancestors millions of years to travel from forest hunting gathering to full-blown civility. In the process, humans created some of the most magnificent civilizations the world has ever known. Most great civilizations are remembered for their contributions to our race as a whole. But with the good comes a lot of bad. While some of these illustrious clusters have stood out for noble causes, others have been known to bring about doom. The greatest civilizations gave us the classics, the pyramids and the scriptures, while others gave us concentration camps, wars and unsurmounted bloodshed. Of course, the latter we choose not to remember, but it's still interesting to learn how and why these terrifying empires broke away into smithereens. Here's a look at some of the most terrifying civilizations the world had to witness. Ten, the Nazis. Adolf Hitler, leader of Nationalist Socialist German Workers' Party, and his Nazi Germany was without a doubt one of the most terrifying civilizations in history. The Nazis were not just responsible for concentration camps in their own nation, they gaslight the whole world into starting a war. Also known as the Third Reich in Germany, Hitler and his party smoothly executed the task of turning a democratic republic to a totalitarian state. So what if his tenure was brief? With four million dying in the Holocaust and the worst war the world has ever seen, Nazi Germany was easily the cruelest civilization of the 20th century. Even the party's symbol, the hooked cross, denoting this civilization is considered despicable throughout the world. Sadly, it is often confused with the Hindu swastika, but the two are totally different symbols. 9. The Celts one of the deadliest and most horrific civilizations known, not many people have heard of the Celts as a group. Reputed headhunters, the Celts would pin the heads of their slain victims in chariots or in the front of their homes. Fearless and ruthless, the Celtic warriors wielded long iron swords in wars, hung them on their chariots, and kept singing out loudly until victory was theirs. It might sound totally whacked out, but their style was fighting naked, which was definitely something most of their opponents did not prepare for. In the Celtic civilization, valiance was the hallmark. No wonder, many preserved their achievements, the enemies had to be precise, and made a proud exhibition in front of the world. 8. The Mongols Akin to savages and barbarians, this civilization's domination was mostly in Eurasia during the 13th and 14th centuries. It was the unification of Mongol and the tribes of the Turks that ultimately became symbolic to bloodshed under the dynamic leadership of Genghis Khan. One would have been left absolutely spellbound the way these people organized themselves and achieved mastery in archery and horse riding. As per estimates, almost 30 million to 60 million people died for or because of their conquests that started in 1207 and ended in 1472. Here's a little fact that puts things in perspective. The Mongols conquered more territory in 25 years than the Romans did in 400. When Genghis Khan, the man behind the rise of the Mongol Empire died in 1227, his body was buried in an unmarked grave. All those who participated in the burial were killed to keep the burial location a secret. 7. The Romans The greatest empire ever known also had its share of fury. Think of some of the most evil men in history and without doubt, they turn out to be Romans. Caligula, Nero and few others made for one of the most egregious civilizations ever heard of. In fact, Emperor Nero in the 64, persecuted Christians en masse, with some thrown to starving dogs and others burnt alive. Initially ruled by divine emperors, the country soon became a republic and then an empire. Perhaps only legend can explain how a small group of wolf-fending sheepherders gathered such a terrific military and administrative system that constituted the unfathomable length and breadth of the Roman Empire. If you remember the deadly gladiator wars, it was the contribution of the Roman army. From England to Spain, France to Greece, the Middle East to North African coastal regions all came under the territory of Rome and lasted for a whopping 2,214 years. 
Truly, Rome was never built in a day. 6. The Aztecs A certain ethnic group of central Mexico speaking the Nahuatl language spread terror in large parts of Mesoamerica from the 14th to the 16th centuries. Better known as the Aztecs, human sacrifices, or cannibalism, formed their chief characteristic. Did you ask why? The belief that with the passing of every 52 years, the world is likely to come to an end if the gods weren't strong enough had the Aztecs sacrifice their human counterparts to please the sun god. Atop a hill, pounding hearts of humans were cut open, and some were even consumed in totality. Drowning, beheading, dropping from great heights and even burning were few other chosen methods of ending lives. Besides the sun, even the rain god was worshipped in a ghastly manner. The Aztecs held that crying children please the rain god and bring in fresh showers. As a result, they made children cry with unfathomable techniques whenever they prayed for rain. One of the worst civilizations in the world, the Aztecs defined evil perfectly. 5. Maori People Fear and cruelty were pronounced aspects of Maoris, the indigenous Polynesian people who first settled in New Zealand before Europeans. Hardcore cannibals, this group of people literally consumed their enemy's flesh or that of any outsider to their territory. If you happened to be an unfortunate victim of these savage warriors, there would be no coming back home. Even if you did somehow manage to break free, you would be left with a lifetime of dread because most of your shipmates gave their lives to save you. This practice was believed to impart strength and other necessary skills to this amazing yet haunted indigenous civilization. Unfortunately, the Maori people's race faced a demographic decline ever since people from Europe started settling in New Zealand. It is believed that the last of the Maoris died between 1440 and 1445, bringing about the extinction of the tribe. 4. Apache Tribes Comanches or Apache tribes were basically Native Americans who hailed from a place called Comancheria which comprised New Mexico, southwestern Kansas, western Oklahoma, southeastern Colorado, and most of northwest Texas. The Apache exhibited true fearlessness in battles. Often called the Ninjas of America, this deadly group was skilled in primitive weapons made of bones, stones and skulls. From slitting throats to badgering opponents with a tomahawk or throwing axe, the people of this tribe competed fiercely against foreign military. Adept in hit and run fighting, the trend carried on among their descendants who are known to teach modern-day special forces the art of fighting in hand-to-hand -hand combat. 3. The Vikings Vikings were North Germanic people who raided, traded, plundered and eventually settled down in parts of North Atlanta and Eurasia in between the late 8th to mid-11th centuries. These people formed a clan of the most valiant fighters in human history. At least, that's what the TV shows tell us. Use of weapons like axes, swords, and spears were so well known to them that no one proved a worthy match to these super valiant people priding in their physical strength. Perhaps the only civilization whose religious beliefs rested in war, Vikings were outstanding when it came to battlefields and fighting till the end of their lives. 2. Soviet Union Official figures say that communism has taken more lives than the Nazis. Blame it on Mao Zedong, Pol Pot, Joseph Stalin, and several others who found solace in merciless killing. However, Soviet Union stands the worst, with Stalin alone murdering about 10 to 60 million people. So horrifying was his reign that even the most average person shuddered at the thought of fearless survival. One of USA's strongest enemies, Stalin's Soviet Union stood out for being one of the most vengeful tribes of men the world has seen. 1. The Spartans The word Spartan describes simplicity and self-denial, values that were embraced by the ancient Greek state of Sparta. Nothing could be more horrifying to parents than knowing that their babies belonged to the state more than them. Remember, these are the same people who held off thousands of Persians with an army of 300 men in the famous Battle of Thermopylae. No wonder, every single Spartan male was a soldier and retired exactly at the age of 60. Those who died in battles that ended in victory got marked with commemorative headstones, but anyone losing the shield during a battle was proportionately penalized. 
Only a warrior whose heroism would be marveled by future generations was presented with a royal grave. A severely patriotic people, soldiers of this clan were hailed as legendary warriors and inspired valor in friends and enemies alike. So, those were some of the most terrifying yet majestic people known to us. Did we miss out on another legendary warrior race? Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos. Remember to press the bell icon to receive instant notifications. We will see you again with another amazing story. Till then, Bella Ciao.